Welcome to Fabric Monday. Today we'll talk about monitoring executions with Data Activator. What's the point? We need to know when an scheduled execution fails. We use notebooks to create ingestion pipelines to Microsoft Fabric environment. We use data pipelines for the same. We need to know when one specific execution of the data pipelines or one specific execution of the notebooks fails to run. How can we do that? Let's take a look. Here I have a Fabric workspace with some notebooks. One of the notebooks is called Load Orders. How can I identify if this load orders at some moment fails one, one specific shadow execution? Let's take a look on Real Time Hub. Here in Real Time Hub, I can select the option of Fabric Events, events related to Microsoft Fabric. So, Fabric Events, and among the Fabric Events, I have the Job Events. Events related to execution jobs. So job events and I have these options, these events to choose from. I have the item job succeed and item job failed. I can be advised if the job succeeded or if the job failed. Set an alert. Select the event. I have four types of events. Let's say that I want only to be advised if the job fails. And by item, by workspace or by item. Let's select my item, which is, it is in the workspace parallel demo. And I select my item, lower the orders. So I want to monitor the item job fail event on the Parallel Demo Workspace Lowered Orders Notebook. If this notebook fails to run, I will be notified. Next, save. I can use the usual notification methods for data activators, send an email, send a things message and so on. But I provided a video before on Fabric Monday about how to work around the limitations of these methods. I can choose to run a Fabric item and choose a data pipeline to execute. I will not proceed until the end result, but I could choose a data pipeline. And this data pipeline could be doing both, could be sending me an email and a Teams message, for example. But just to proceed, let's choose the send an email, and then I need to create the item. What I mean create the item? I mean this alert will generate an activator object inside the place that I choose. I can choose the parallel demo workspace, for example, or I can create a special workspace for monitoring objects and save all the activators which will be monitoring my ingestion inside this monitoring workspace. This is also an option. And then I choose to create a new item and give a name to this activator. Uh, monitor load orders. And create. That's it. The object is created, the activator object is created using the name Monto Load Orders. I can open the object immediately and customize the object. We had some videos about this before uh, and I can take a look on the workspace. And here in the workspace I will locate my activator object, Monto Load Orders. In this way, I'll be capable to receive email alerts every time my notebook execution fails. Thank you very much for watching and see you next week.